It's your man, Ken the Bust a Move, man. I've been, been meaning to drop this video for a little while now. And I said I was gonna drop it out, and I'm dropping it right now. Cause I mean, like I said, I had a great conversation with a good man. You know what I'm saying? My man Deck, man, we played 2K, you know what I'm saying? All the 2Ks together, you know what I'm saying? We on 23 right now. And we was having a discussion about the mind state of in the streets and in the penitentiary. And you gotta keep in mind this right here. In these streets, man, you know, you got everything to do but not enough time in the penitentiary. You got nothing to do but so much time. And, you know, it's all on, you could be what you want to be. You could try to, you know, throw the facade on who you are as a person. You could try to throw the facade on what you was doing out in the streets. But at the end of the day, you got to stand 10 toes down and you got to really, really show where your backbone at. Because at the end of the day, you can't go but so far in that penile system, man. You know, you're gonna be you're gonna be easy accessible because, you know, the homies got a lot of it's it's a lot of uh it's a lot of ways to send them kites and things of that nature, man. So it becomes very um it becomes very meticulous. It, it becomes very, you know, uh 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 being very being, use your strategy and strategic on how you move. It's the art of war. 48 Laws of Power, you know what I'm saying? A great book that that, that, that was, I, I had the pleasure of reading when I was incarcerated was Who Moved the Cheese? You know what I'm saying? When you think of that book and you, you hear that title, you think in your mind, you'd be like, that don't even make sense. But once you read the book, it breaks down for you the, the mindset of people, man, on trying to ex excel, you know what I'm saying? And like I say, it's a lot of guys out here who couldn't even understand the mindset of being in the penitentiary, you know what I'm saying? Like I was telling, I was telling someone earlier, I was just having a discussion with a good man you know, and a dude that walked between us and didn't say, excuse me, didn't say, excuse me, fellas, nothing. That's that's real live grounds for death behind that G-Wall. If you cross two men talking and you don't and you don't say, excuse me, or you don't take your time to acknowledge that two men were just talking and you just interrupted them, being rude, you, you, know, you, might, you might easily have a beef on your hands that you don't even know why you're beefing. Because, you, because you're not educated on how to move or the mind state behind that wall or out here in these streets of society. And that's why I say, man, a lot of you dudes, man, get very territorial, and y'all don't understand that. That's why, you know, being from the DMV, being a land of a person, you know, DMV stands for D.C., Maryland, and Virginia. Being from Maryland, you know what I'm saying, lived in D.C., never lived in Virginia, but, you know, respect a lot of good VA men. So I done met a couple of cold-blooded soldiers that come from Virginia. Me and my man Deck had a discussion that men respect men, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, you just can't be running around here screaming DC or a hard hood in Maryland or a hard hood in Virginia, and you can't stand on it. You know what I'm saying? Because once you gotta go behind that wall, you know what I'm saying, what car you gonna get in? Are you gonna get with the homies? Are you gonna get in the DC blacks, the DC car? Are you gonna, you know what I'm saying, be a civilian? Are you gonna be, are you gonna function? Are you gonna, you know what I'm saying? It, it, it's a lot of things, man, you know, because right now, you know, and and on my side of town, man, you gotta keep in mind this right here, that the gang activity is really, truth be told, is frowned upon. But anyway, you look at it, it's an organization in whatever you do. When you at a job, when you working somewhere, that's an organization that you work for, that you represent. You know what I'm saying? When you uh when you when you behind that fence and you got your men you running with, what is what is one, two, three, four? 50 to 100, that's a vibe, that's an organization that you are running with. So are you going to respect the organization, respect the vibe, respect and understand the culture that come with it, or are you going to disrespect it and be goofy, be a clown, you know what I'm saying? Not understand the culture that come with that, you know? So like I say, imagine wanted to come on here and tell y'all, man, my train of thought and my thoughts on you know, being very territorial, my thoughts on being respectful, my thoughts on understanding the culture, man, between behind that wall, because the simplest way I could put it is, you could you could be out here and you got so much time, you got so much to do and not enough time behind that wall, you ain't got nothing to do but nothing but time. So you know what I'm saying? You you're gonna start strategizing and you're gonna start thinking how to how to, you know what I'm saying, pass your time. And are you passing it properly or are you passing it violently? Are you passing it productive or are you passing it miserable? Out here, man, you know what I'm saying? You can come out here, man, and you can, you can put the, the water on somebody's eyes and the facade out there, and you can just go ahead and say, man, you know what? 
man, I don't, I don't like the way this is moving here. I'm going to move to here. Or I'm going to move to there. Or I'm going to move there. You can't do that behind that G-wall, man. You know what I'm saying? So that's just a food for thought, man. That's your man, Kenna Bustle Move, man. Get him on YouTube. Hey, shooting this video live in Las Vegas, Nevada. You know what I'm saying? You can catch me anywhere. Any place at any given time, man. Giving it to you, man. General YouTuber, man. Giving you my train of thought on how I see things. You know what I'm saying? And I've been meaning to drop this video. And there's many more videos to come. If you're not subscribed to my channel, man, hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button, man. And follow my journey on this thing that I call life. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, man, it's, 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 it's February. It's Black History Month, man. It's my birthday month. It's my kids. You know, my family, my mother. Like I say, it's it's their birthday month, man. So just keep supporting, man. Stay focused, stay solid, man, and keep up with me. It's your man, can I bust a move around my